Dear Future Carla, Today is January 3rd, 2020. This is the third video entry log for um, this Dear Carla series. I'm here with Sol, and um, today um, I wanted to do a quick video before everybody came over for Friday night game night. Um, in case you're not doing it anymore, future Carla, every Friday night I get together with my friends and uh, we do game night. And this consists of um, like three to like ten of us getting together to play board games together. These, boards gave, these board games range from Red Dragon Inn, Bang, what else? What else have we played? Uh, code names, Apples to Apples, Munchkin, and other games that people bring and play. I'm not sure what we're gonna play today, but we have around like, we have like around five confirmed coming, so that's gonna be really exciting. And um, Board Game Night has been really important in my development and my growth. And it's been really important to like, get together with my friends and have like a a routine or like a daily habit that we do together so that way we can keep our bonds close and not get lost in the rat race as they say like you know working eating sleeping working eating sleeping so this kind of friday night board game night it's been really important we've been doing it for like around two three years now and it's been a huge huge part of my life and I always love doing game night however I'm also really awkward and camera shy if you haven't noticed it yet so I'd rather get this video recording done before everyone gets here and not while everyone else is in the other room listening to me talk to you future Carla or you know whoever's watching these you know video diaries Something else that was really cool um, from the difference between day one and day three of doing these things. I realized I could create custom thumbnails. Now I know that sounds really silly because no dove, there's custom thumbnails on YouTube all the time. But I didn't realize that as a new YouTube creator that I had the ability to create custom thumbnails. I thought that was a thing that like you needed to upload a certain amount of videos to create a custom thumbnail, but no. I could create custom thumbnails, which is really awesome, and I've been keeping it really low key and low maintenance. Um, instead of like spending a lot of time doing a different thumbnail for all these uh, video diary entries, I used like some kind of um, template on Canva, and I just changed like the little portrait that's like the little Polaroid picture that's in it, and I changed like the number that's in that's written on the Polaroid, and then that's it. Like, I decided to keep it really low-key maintenance. Um, another thing that I did to keep these video entries as quick, easy, and painless as possible is I've decided to start editing on iMovie on my iPod or my iPad. Like, instead of taking this video that's on the iPad and bringing it into my computer and then using that iMovie, I just do all the video editing right here on this little iPad and like I don't even do that heavy of video editing editing to be honest. Like past me past me would be so stressed about getting the right perfect content out to you guys that past me would spend hours cutting and making sure that every single word I say is pristine that even the shot is even is better and current me is like no we're gonna learn quick and fast we're gonna be doing these videos every day we're gonna learn new tricks every single time we're gonna get better with public speaking and we're just gonna rock it so like in the short amount of time i've been doing these video entries um i've learned so much like even my description my description from day one was nothing compared to the description I now have. I now have links to my website, I have links to my Redbubble shop, I have links to uh, Solaris's uh, Instagram as well, 
And if you see me dancing around, it's just because he's a baby. He wants to move around and explore, and he doesn't really like this like video entry thing. He'd rather run around, explore the room, and check things out. He's usually most still at nighttime, and that's because he's usually sleepy. But now he's like active, he's awake, he wants to explore. He just ate like a bunch of crickets. He's getting so big. And I don't know, it's been really cool doing these video entries. They've been very experimental, very quick, and it, they're not perfect at all. In fact, this is how imperfect they are. I meant to put this on. I've had this in front of me the entire time. I'm supposed to be wearing this for video quality. I don't even know if this microphone makes a difference in the audio quality. I tried it out yesterday. I didn't really see much of a difference. I guess today I'll know between the beginning of the audio and now that I have it right in front of me. But yeah, I think I'm going to end it really quickly because uh, people are going to be coming soon and I'd rather quickly cut and prepare this video before anybody comes and finds out that I have a YouTube channel that I'm uploading stuff on and then they can watch me and then they'll be like, oh Carla, you sounded so awkward. Or they'll more realistically be like, oh Carla, that's so cool that you're doing this. But I know I don't sound the best and I know it's because I haven't practiced and he, this is my practice. Once I get really good, I'll probably hide all these videos or maybe I'll keep them. We'll see. We'll see how the, the vibe of the channel is and we'll see how forgiving people are in terms of mistakes. I hope a lot of people are forgiving of mistakes. I mean, I'm very big about growing and learning and I wouldn't be able to learn how to be really awesome like a lot of YouTubers out there if I don't practice and if I don't learn from any mistakes. So I'm hoping I could keep these public so that way anyone who's interested in starting their own YouTube channel, they'll be like, oh hey, I could do it too because this girl, she started from like nothing and she was really lame. So I would love to compare the videos from like a year from now to like the first ones I've done here. So that way I could see how much I improved. And I'd love to keep it public for, you know, future Carla and future whoever decides to check out these videos. Anyways, yeah, I'm gonna go. I'm really bad with saying goodbye if you haven't noticed. So, ciao!